General Store on 24 is located on Route 24 in Lewis. Headlines, headlines you can't get through your day without. On Power 101.7. All right, 638. Jess, what you got today? All right, so there is a Florida ex-congressman who has been arrested. This is a former Miami congressman who signed a $50 million consulting contract with Venezuela and their socialist government. Was arrested on Monday charges with money laundering and representing a foreign government without registering. David Rivera, a Republican who served from 2011 to 2013, was arrested at Atlanta's airport. So as soon as we get more information on that, we will definitely fill you in. Also, lawyer Michael Avenatti, who rose to fame representing Stormy Daniels against Donald Trump, was sentenced in California on Monday to 14 years in prison for cheating clients out of millions of dollars. Two and a half years after it was announced that New York City would spend $157 million to build a broadband infrastructure in poor neighborhoods, city officials have quietly canceled the plan. The expansion, which no longer exists, was the second phase of the 2020 Internet Master Plan. This was going to be a massive endeavor launched uh, by de Blasio and their administration. It was aimed to connect 1.2 million New Yorkers to free or low-cost high-speed Internet. But that project has quietly now been canceled. Pfizer is asking U.S. regulators to authorize its updated COVID-19 vaccine for children under the age of five, not as a booster, but as part of the initial shots. Children ages six months to four years already are supposed to get the three extra small doses of the original Pfizer COVID-19 vaccine, each a tenth of the amount that adults receive as their primary series. If the Food and Drug Administration agrees, a dose of Pfizer's Omicron targeting vaccine would be substituted for their third shot. Salisbury is now announcing a start date and details for this single use plastic bag ban. This has been trending. If you live in Salisbury, get ready to say goodbye to single use plastic bags. It is the mission for the city to address these issues. Um, Mayor Jake Day told everyone at a press conference that starting on July the 1st, 2023, single use plastic bags are going to be banned from retail and restaurant establishments in Salisbury. Paper bags will cost shoppers 10 cents each. Mayor Day says that the money will go directly back to the businesses. All right. So we're going to have Mayor Jake Day on tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, at 820. Yep. And we're going to get back in the routine every other Wednesday. So we'll ask him about it. Okay. And we'll talk about yeah. it. I think I've gotten used to at least starting to. Just because because they're still legal in Maryland. We still have, it's just Salisbury they're going to do it. So they're taking the initiative on their own. Right. Um, but I know just from Delaware and other states that, you know, we travel to or whatever. Yeah. I think I've gotten used to not having the bags. You have? I think so. Okay. Well, you don't live here and you don't do it every day. <laughs> 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 How about that? You got used to it because you only experienced okay, it once well, in a while. Well, <laughs> um, you don't live here. <laughs> well, as long as they have like the boxes. Yeah. Now, if everything's in the boxes, we're now, okay. They don't have that though, like at grocery stores and stuff. They do it at BJ's. Yeah, but they're going to give you something. Like you don't go into, you don't go into. You're, you're not going to have to go into like a Walmart or a Food Line or a grocery store. No, they have the paper bags and, now, and you pay. Yeah, for I was going to say you're not going to lo have to load up. Some places and are not five have cents. nothing. Yeah, five cents a bag or ten cents a bag. The paper bags you pay for, like yeah. the like the book covers. Yeah. Okay. Because yeah. I've never seen where you pay for them. Mm -hmm. Everywhere I go, there's always something that you can like. There's some alternative, oh, but you yeah. don't pay for it. Mm -hmm. Like you can pay for like the 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 what do you call them? Now, at Walmart, I don't know if they make you pay there. I don't think they do. They don't. I'm talking about the grocery stores. Well, that is a grocery store. But, so that, that's a grocery oh, I don't store. I do my groceries there. Yeah, well, see, that's where we go to. So that's the, and you don't have to pay for them. So mm -hmm. that's why I'm not, you, like, that's why I'm saying, like, what, what are you paying for? The, there's always some alternative that I, I've run yeah, into. Yeah, at the grocery store we go, it's paper bags, you pay. That's it. That, or take your own bag, but I always forget. Now, when... Again, like I've said this before, when my girls go to Aldi, yeah, they have a routine mm -hmm. where they go because Aldi you doesn't said they do. They take their own bags, right? They take their yeah. own bags. Yeah, they know they're going. They mm -hmm. take their own bags, and they're they used have a to system. it. Yeah, yeah, they're used to it now. So that's so they they've they're okay with that. Mm -hmm. 
Um, but as far as like going to like the grocery, but I, Food Lion, you don't either. But for, oh, wait, Food Lion's still doing the plastic. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, no, there's I've never paying for the the paper brown bags to me is a little much. And we'll ask Mary Jake tomorrow about That's it. Fine, yeah. But like I said, there's always been now, everywhere we've gone. There's always been an alternative where you could pay. For, well, what is it? What kind it of? It used to be like like when you go to Wawa, the thicker plastic bags. That was at Wawa here in Delaware. Yeah, the Wawa did it. The thicker one. No, 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 no. That's a Wal- I mean Walmart. That that was yeah, a Walmart. Yeah, the thicker ones. Yeah. And I was even fine with those. Yeah, but I don't know. I, I think um, the paper bags. No, just a big fat no. I'll never <laughs> agree to the paper bag. But if, but if you don't have to pay for them, I don't even care about paying for it. They suck. They- <laughs> you have to do one bag at a time. You can't. It doesn't have the handles right. Right. You can't fill it. It can't be over a certain weight. <laughs> um, you know, when you get home from the grocery store and you put all the bags on your arms and you go in, you yeah. know, you're like out there as a team taking the bags in. Yeah. Not anymore. They well, suck. No, like <laughs> the bag breaks, the stuff falls out, it's going down the stairs. It's it's just a mess. That, it's just they a do. mess. They do. They do suck. So on some places um, it's fine if they, you know, still have the thicker plastic bags, if they come up with an alternative, great. But when the alternative is a paper bag, the alternative is going to be. Sucks. But when you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what's the? I mean, what's worse, plastic or the paper? Like we're taking these paper bags now. You're balling them up. You're not putting them in your trash cans at the house. You know, we've taken in the, the bathroom. Act- you're not using like reusing them for anything. This has nothing to do with that. It sucks. But you know, we, we've taken the extra step in the Walmart, like pickup. What do you mean the extra step? We've had them delivered. To your house? Yeah. And? It's even great. better, right? Yeah, <laughs> yes. even better. Yes, yes. It is fantastic. You said the extra step. Oh, I mean, is there much more difference in the cost? Like, what is there? My wife does it. I don't oh, know. okay. But I mean, I know it's something for the convenience. I had a buddy. I, if it was I had a buddy who used to, who's been doing it for like a year since COVID. Okay. Yeah, he's been doing it for since 2020. Yeah. And, um, you know, we would do, we because we, we, you know, we rarely go in and, like, load up anymore, or, like, at all. Okay. It's always the Walmart pickup. Yeah. Because who has time to waste two hours to mm-hmm. go in to load up anymore? Uh, so we would go to, um, you know, Walmart and do the pickup. And sometimes Food Lion, because you can do the pickup there. Uh, but... Now they have the Walmart delivery. So my wife the other day was like, oh, I put a grocery order in. And I said, oh, what time? And she's like, oh, no, they're bringing it here. Stop. So Stop. it's just like a door dash. Like they come up, they load them on the porch, they knock on your door, and then and the, they, they roll leave. out. Yeah, they roll out. There's no checking. There's no even talk. There's It's contactless. Yeah. So you open your door and you have a whole thing All full of groceries. There. Yeah. Yes. Love it. Love it. <laughs> Love it's a it. Oh, new world. Yes, it is. I, I freaking love it. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Well, since you still have the plastic bags and it's like not a big deal for you, I'm going to give you my paper bags and you bring me your plastic. <laughs> yeah. Now, look, I'm not saying. Can you say, can you bring me some? <laughs> <laughs> look, I'm, I'm not paying. saying. I'm not I'll saying it's not plastic. a big deal. I'll pay for the plastic bag. I'm starting to like get over it. I'm starting to be just because I've been forced to. And again, we're all creatures of habit. I don't like change, so I'm, but I'm starting to like make myself do this. Like, oh well, you know what? I got to do it anyway, so I'm used to it. So it is yeah. what it is. Like I, I was the first one to bitch about it like crazy. Mm-hmm. I was the biggest bitcher. But you also say that you have now changed, like your shopping habits. Yes. Like maybe you would feel differently if you are going in, if you are loading up, and then you get there and you're loading everything in paper bags. Well, you have to change. You know, and it's doing all that. You have to change your life. <laughs> yes, uh, you have to change your life. I'm just not ready to do well, that. Well, that, that. Yeah. Don't want to hear nothing. You're not ready because yeah, if you're not, not ready, ready, the universe will go full force I'm in front of you. Ready. Nope, you got to change with the times. I like to see what I'm getting. Oh, well, you will. You'll see and, it when you unload it. Yeah. Now, I have tried... The curbside a couple of times on just a few things. Nothing right. like groceries, though. Not like a big order like that. And what I find has happened to me a few times is like the substitution. Well, you have to accept them. You, I know, but yeah. sometimes it's like, 
then if it's like not what I need or want, then you say no, then like I'm back to going in that store or another store. No, so, gotta, sometimes, you know, sometimes that happens. Like still go shopping is and what I'm saying. Yeah, but sometimes. On, and it's not, it's just like different things that I'm getting. Yeah, but it's uh, same with us. Same yeah. with us. Sometimes that will happen where you got to do the substitutions and you don't like their substitutions and you're like, oh, I bet you if I go in there, I can find something that I really want yeah. or whatever. That will happen. But the big picture in the long run, it's still worth doing the pickup. It will still save yeah. you. It will still yeah, yeah, save yeah. you time. I'm just saying my experience on what I've had to get. Yeah, every once in a while yeah. that'll happen, but it will still benefit. But and save I you have time. not done like a big order of groceries or anything oh, like that. We yeah. we haven't done a big order while walking in the store mm -hmm. in a long time. Yeah, you know, so yeah. is what it is. Uh, let's see, three four four texted in Jess. You can buy plastic bags in bulk from Amazon. You can. I guess so. You know what, babe. <laughs> I'm on it. I am on it. Thank you. We are on it right Thank now. you, uh, Leela. Thank you for checking in. Thank you so much. Anything else, Jess? No, I think we're good. All right, we'll talk to, we'll, we will talk to Mayor Jake yes. Day tomorrow morning at 820 uh, about the whole plastic bag thing just in Salisbury. Okay. So Plus some other things as well. Looking forward to getting him back on. It's 650. It's a Bill and Jessica show. We got sports coming up next. Right after Kalani.